Divine Ones As the pink moon approaches on April 6, 2023, a sense of excitement and anticipation is in the air. After weeks of focusing on personal goals and individual growth, the universe is now calling for us to turn our attention towards our relationships and connections with others. The pink moon will take place the evening of Wednesday, April 5, 2023. Its peak is technically at 12.37 a.m. Eastern Time on Thursday, April 6. This celestial event carries a spiritual meaning that speaks to the importance of unity and togetherness. As we bask in its luminance, we are invited to take a step back and reflect on our own desires, but also to consider how we can support and uplift those around us. It's a time to be generous with our time and attention, and to cultivate deeper, more meaningful connections with the people in our lives. It seems there are some dates you must absolutely be cautious of, Divine Ones. I can't stress enough how vital it is to avoid scheduling anything significant during these periods. You certainly wouldn't want your precious efforts to go in vain. The moon will be void, also known as V.O. This news can evoke feelings of uncertainty and apprehension, leaving us wondering what to expect. When we say the moon is void, we mean that it is in a period where it is not making any major aspects to other planets. This can last anywhere from a few minutes to several hours, depending on the duration of the void period. This mysterious and often overlooked astrological event can catch us off guard if we're not prepared. It's essential to be aware of these periods, as they might bring a bit of uncertainty and disarray to our lives. Now, mark these periods with a bold red in your calendar. From April 1st at 11.03 p.m. till April 2th at 3.57 a.m., when the moon enters Virgo. On April 4th between 6.50 a.m. and 2.51 p.m., when the moon enters Libra. On April 6th between 5.43 a.m. and 11.29 p.m., when the moon enters Scorpio. On April 9th between 2.09 a.m. and 5.57 a.m., when the moon enters Sagittarius. On 11th between 3.48 a.m. and 10.33 a.m., when the moon enters Capricorn. On 13th between 7.14 a.m. and 1.42 p.m., when the moon enters Aquarius. On 15th between 8.16 a.m. and 3.57 p.m., when the moon enters Pisces. On 17th between 11.57 a.m. and 6.09 p.m., when the moon enters Aries. On 19th between 9.13 p.m. and 9.30 p.m., when the moon enters Taurus. From April 21st at 8.41 p.m. till 22 th at 3.11 a.m., when the moon enters Gemini. On 24th between 5.15 a.m. and 11.58 a.m., when the moon enters Cancer. On 26th between 4.41 p.m. and 11.30 p.m., when the moon enters Leo. On 29th between 3.53 a.m. and 11.59 a.m., when the moon enters Virgo. So, what can you do during these puzzling periods? It's best to avoid starting new projects, making important decisions, or committing to long-term agreements. Instead, try to focus on completing tasks you've already begun or take a moment for reflection and introspection. Now, what does this mean for us, dear Earthlings? Well, during the moon void of course, our intuition, emotions, and decision-making abilities might be a tad off-kilter. It's as if we're all a little out of tune with the cosmic orchestra, which could lead to unexpected outcomes and even confusion. Be mindful of the moon void of course, and don't let its cosmic uncertainty take you by surprise. Embrace the opportunity to pause, reflect, and prepare for your next big move when the cosmic energies are in your favor. In the other hand, this full moon is a time of heightened intuition and emotional intensity, a time when we may feel more deeply connected to ourselves and others. It's a time to reflect on our innermost thoughts and desires, and to release any negative emotions that may be holding us back. During this full pink moon, there are many spiritual meanings and intentions that we can cultivate in our lives to bring about positive change. Here are some powerful qualities that can help us navigate our journey. Intuition, 
trusting your inner voice and following your instincts can lead you to where you need to be. When we listen to our intuition, we're better able to make decisions that align with our highest good. Generosity, giving of ourselves, whether it be our time, resources, or energy, can be incredibly rewarding. It's a way of showing kindness and compassion to others, and it can also inspire others to do the same. Productivity, when we set goals and take action towards them, we feel a sense of accomplishment and purpose. Productivity helps us to feel more in control of our lives and can lead to greater success. Courage, sometimes, we need to face our fears and take bold steps forward. Having courage means pushing through our doubts and insecurities and believing in ourselves and our abilities. Lightheartedness, laughter and playfulness can bring joy to our lives and help us to relax and enjoy the moment. Taking things lightly can also help us to not take ourselves too seriously and find humor in difficult situations. Progress, moving forward, even if it's just small steps, can be incredibly empowering. When we see progress, we're motivated to keep going and achieve even more. Fertility, this can refer to physical fertility, but it can also mean being open to new ideas and experiences. Fertility is about being receptive and creating space for growth and expansion. Potency, this refers to our ability to create and manifest. When we tap into our potency, we're able to bring our ideas to fruition and create positive change in our lives and in the world around us. Innovation, embracing new ideas and being open to change can lead to exciting possibilities. Innovation means thinking outside the box and finding creative solutions to problems. Change, change is inevitable, and it can be scary. But it can also be an opportunity for growth and transformation. Embracing change means being willing to let go of what no longer serves us and being open to new possibilities. Adaptability, being adaptable means being able to roll with the punches and adjust to new situations. It means being flexible and resilient in the face of challenges. New growth, just as spring brings new growth, we can cultivate new beginnings in our lives. Whether it's a new project, a new relationship, or a new mindset, new growth brings fresh opportunities and a sense of renewal. What is the meaning of this full moon in Libra? Libra, the sign of balance and harmony, is all about finding equilibrium in our relationships and interpersonal connections. It reminds us that the people in our lives are essential to our emotional well-being and that we must strive to maintain healthy and balanced relationships. However, this balancing act requires effort and introspection on our part. It's our responsibility to examine our connections and identify any areas where we may be falling short. This is a time to reflect on any relationships where we may be self-serving or not pulling our weight, and to consider what we can do to show up fully for ourselves and for those around us. Libra teaches us the importance of fairness and equality in our relationships, and it calls upon us to examine any places where our connections may be one-sided. It's a time to ask ourselves what we can do to improve our relationships and bring more harmony and understanding into our lives. This lunar cycle is all about balance, and the Libra scales of justice symbolize that perfectly. It's time to put our differences aside and come together to find that equilibrium we've been missing. This is a time for forgiveness and honesty. If you're feeling like something is off kilter, it's okay to acknowledge it and ask for what you need. Sometimes, the process of finding balance can be disruptive, but that's a sign that things are shifting in the right direction. It's all about harnessing the powerful energy of the universe to bring about positive change in our lives. When it comes to manifesting, your mood and emotions are key. It's essential to be in the right mindset when putting energy out into the universe. That means cultivating a sense of potent optimism and positive thinking. This full moon is a powerful time to focus on what you want to manifest in your life. Visualize your desires with clarity and intention, and trust in the universe to bring them to fruition. Whether you're looking for abundance, love, or success, the universe is ready and waiting to help you manifest your dreams. Remember, manifesting is about more than just wishful thinking. 
It's about taking action and aligning your energy with your goals. By putting in the effort and staying focused on your desires, you'll create an unstoppable energy cocktail that will propel you toward success. Don't be afraid to embrace this energy and make the necessary adjustments in your life. Whether it's mending a relationship or re-evaluating your priorities, the universe is supporting you in finding that sweet spot. Trust in the process, and know that when the scales of justice are balanced, everything falls into place. I believe that with your new fifth dimensional divine guidance from within, you will be able to create a life beyond your wildest dreams. I know that this journey may not be easy, but I'm here to support you every step of the way. We'll go through this together, and as long as you continue to watch our channel and complete our assignments, you'll be on the path towards manifesting your desires. So, take a deep breath and trust in the process. You have the power within you to create a life filled with joy, love, and abundance. And remember, God is present inside you, guiding you every step of the way. I'd love to hear your thoughts about this video in the comments section below. Your feedback is important to us, and we appreciate you taking the time to share your experiences with us. For further information, check out the links provided in the video description or visit our website. Together, we can create a world filled with unlimited abundance and prosperity. Sincerely yours, DNA Awakening.